Hello everyone, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can create this beautiful letterhead design in Microsoft Word. First, you need to go to Layout tab. In the size, choose A4 size. And in the margin, choose Narrow Margins. Just get to this Insert tab. In the Shape option, insert a rectangle like this. Change its color to dark blue. Right click over it, go to shape format. Here you can see edit shape option. Click on edit points, click on this little square right over here, and you can see we have two handles. One is over here, and other is right vertically next to it. Just grab it and bring it up like this. Again, click over here, go to edit shape, edit points, just hold this point and draw it up like this next hold the control key on your keyboard and right click over it and drag it like this to make a copy of this modified version of the rectangle let's go to shape fill option and change its color to yellow again go to edit shape click on edit points hold this particular point and drag it up again like this Next, right click over it and send it to back. Now adjust its position. Again, double click. Go to shape outline and makes no outline. Again, click on this modified yellow rectangle. Hold the control key and make it and duplicate it like this. Let's change its color to blue. Go to edit shape option, edit points and simply hold this hold it from the corner and draw it up as you have done before let's right click over it and send it to back now adjust its position like this right click again go to edit shape and edit points and simply click over here drag it up leave it over here and there we are now the basic design of our letterhead is ready Click over this dark blue rectangle, hold the shift key, click on yellow rectangle and likewise this blue rectangle, right click again and group them like this. Next, we'll duplicate this. So hold the control key and drag it down like this. Simply bring it to the bottom, hold it and just reverse it like this and adjust it at the bottom like this and there we are now you can see our basic design is ready next you can go to insert tab again click on icons and right from here you can insert these icons like this location in the layout options choose this particular option in front of the text and there we are. In this way, you can bring icons for website, telephone number, etc. I have brought in all these icons that I needed right over here onto this particular page and I'm gonna put them right over here. Now, I need to insert all this data right over here. So, you can go to shape option again. In the text box, put a next text box right over here and insert the website like this. Go to shape fill and again i'm going to choose this dark blue color and in this way you can insert the rest of the data as well let me quickly do it so i have placed all this data right over here select all these by pressing the shift key and clicking on them so that i could arrange them vertically go to layout tab and right over here you can see we have align option distribute vertically and there we are Next, you can go to insert tab again, click on pictures, this device and insert your logo. Let me click over it, insert, drag it from the corners to adjust its size to your requirement. Again, in the layout options, choose in front of the text. Let me put it right over here. Similarly, you can insert your company logo as well as your slogan or a tagline right beneath the company logo like this now you can insert let's go again to insert it and insert a line like this right over here hold the shift key and drag it like this let me make it 
like this go to shape outline and choose this one and a half point right over here you can address the person to whom you are addressing in your letter let me put all this data right over here and there you can see it and right in the middle you can write your letter but over here i'm gonna insert this dummy lorem ipsum text right at this left bottom you can again go to insert tab and insert this little line hold the shift key to make it straight one like this and next you can write your name over here next you can come right over here and insert the date go to insert and here you can see we have this data option and I'm gonna choose this format click OK and there we are now you can see our letterhead is almost ready now you might be interested to have your own matter work inserted right in the middle of this letterhead for that you can go to design tab and here on the right side you can see in the page background we have watermark option simply scroll down you can see we have some already prepared sample but we want to insert a custom watermark click on custom watermark and here we have this option picture watermark click over it select picture work offline and I'm gonna choose this attack time logo insert again insert and there you can see our logo inserted right beneath the text now you can see our design is ready you can simply go into the file section and save it in a PDF or whatever format you would like to have it. I'm leaving it as such and that's it for today. I hope you have found this tutorial useful. Please give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching.